when you can't have the real thing, miniature hockey has to do. The three-month NHL lockout hit hard in places like Buffalo, a wintry corner of New York State that loves its local team, the Sabres. With the game set to resume, fans say they're still upset, but more than ready to forgive, if not forget. You hear so many people say, I'm done with it, that's it, I'm finished, I'm finished. When the puck drops, you're glued in. You know, people are going to come back. You know, it's, it's just, they're, they're, they're going to be there. If they have any here for the game of hockey. In fact, the Keenest fans were there just to watch their team practice. Players had only a week to get ready for opening night of this shorter than usual season. Some teams have cut ticket prices and offered free food to coax back supporters fed up with the third lockout in 20 years. You know, you say you're sorry. Uh, you wish it wouldn't have got to this point. You wish it wouldn't have lasted that long. But uh, now that we're back, uh, you know, it's, it's up to us to go out and entertain them. This is a city that needs its hockey. Boarded up buildings, vacant houses, all point to a local economy that can ill afford the loss of tens of thousands of fans no longer spending money in the shops, restaurants and bars. It's not only the restaurant that suffer, it's everybody. It's the taxi cabs, the people that sell the beer, the people that, uh, people that uh, the, the, they, they own a hotel. So it's everybody. But bit by bit, Buffalo is coming back. The hockey arena is part of a new waterfront development that should employ thousands in tourism, hotels and entertainment. Each game injects hundreds of thousands of dollars into an economy that's growing again. It, it took a while. I mean, this opened in 96, I believe. Uh, and they thought that this would, you know, prosper much quicker. Uh, it took a while. Uh, but now it's all starting to come together on the other side of the arena, on this side. Uh, everything's starting to gel. This was once one of the wealthiest cities in North America, but shipping, steel, and other industries collapsed in the 20th century. Now that heritage is being rebuilt to develop a once moribund downtown area, and professional hockey is playing a big part in that. Daniel Lack, Al Jazeera, Buffalo.